Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 461. It's another hard level, so let's spend a minute talking about strategy and mission. We have 55 moves to reach 125,000 points and to clear out all of the jelly on this board, including the stuff trapped under licorice cages and chocolate. But these licorice cages right here on either side, those are going to help to stem the tide of the chocolate that right now can only propagate into the area right next to itself. It can't extend any further. So we're going to have to pay special attention to look for any kind of specials we can make, any kind of um, opportunities to take out a lot of this jelly that's along the edges here. We've got the fish in the central column. Hi fishies! They're going to help us, but we're going to try to wait until the end to deploy them till close to the end anyway, because they'll take out anything that we haven't been able to reach more easily. I see actually an excellent move over here right now. If I move these blue, this purple is supposed to drop here, and this purple would be over here, and I should be able to make a color bomb. It's also going to be taking out five candies, or five jellies at the same time, those layers. I'm going to keep this intact, but I'm going to take out this after I go up into these upper reaches. These upper reaches are very difficult to, to get to, and remember we want the fish to play cleanup, so we have to remove as much as we can. Coming back over to this side now, or coming to this side for the first time on this level. Taking out that jelly and the licorice, and even the frosting. We want to save the fish, but we can't keep them forever, and you know, there's some advantage of taking out this frosting. Anywhere there's not frosting, there can be a candy. All right, so I can match this with either orange, or yellow, or red. I don't want to do red. It's going to open both of these up. I'm not ready for that. There's not a lot of yellow on the board. I think I'm going to go for orange. It'll open up this. It'll concentrate the colors left on the board and hopefully allow me to make some more specials or other matches that can be beneficial. Remember, where I take out the jelly, that's where the fish doesn't have to go. I'm kind of flying through these moves. I should slow down and contemplate them more. That's a nice thing to set up if I can deploy. All right, that wants to make a color bomb. Not quite there yet. We're probably end up going to end up sending out these fish pretty soon just by cascading. Here we go. We're going to make a special and send it out that way. Oh, good. They tend to school together. And so since we had a lot removed up here, they targeted down here. I like that. We're going to make another special. We're going to deploy two specials and create a special and probably take out a fish and all sorts of fun things. Before I do that, let me see if there's any more hope to traveling this down lower. I just don't see it. I don't see this paying off in the long run. And there at least we got a special out of it. Okay, so now while we've hit, it can only grow on this side. I'm going to go ahead and take this out and hopefully one will land here and make a nice striped candy and take everything out. Yes! Now I only have one chocolate left, and that chocolate has nowhere to go. It can only propagate on a tile that is populated by a candy that is vertically or horizontally adjacent to it. And there's nothing on the board matching that description. 
so I've bought myself a little bit of time to deal with the chocolate. Hopefully I'll be able to make a striped candy to hit down here or something comparable. I have to be careful with what I do around here now. Striped or wrapped? Striped because I can hit it hor uh, vertically. If it were horizontal, I would probably make it a different choice. Take out more of this jelly so that when the fish is finally released, it goes to the area I need it to target. All right, I'm going to go ahead and do a couple of moves here that may change what the chocolate does. All right. Oh, wanted to use those in combo, but I think the moves I made were good anyway, so I can't be too upset. And I tell you what, this is a hard level. We're getting so close to finishing now. If I've got to play cleanup at the end and I don't have stuff to do it, I may use a, a special or two. On these hard levels, my motto is booster up, baby. Okay, not really. I just made that up on the spot. But All right, let's see if we can get this detonated. First, I'm going to check any other specials I can create. I'm just going to see about these purples. Oh, let's see. Do you know what? This is one of those opportunities where a well-placed booster in the beginning is going to have probably a, a very good impact on the end result. Well, that wasn't very nice. So let me tell you what was supposed to happen there. <laughs> Just like when you... Um, pair up a striped candy and a fish if it lands on like a chocolate or something like that it's it's only going to act like a fish but if it lands on a jelly that has a candy on it it's supposed to act like one of those little bombs that the wrapped candy creates it didn't quite go that way for me all right We've got to get some of these things we've created detonated in the short amount of time we have available to us. Let's see if we can set off a chain reaction here. There we go. Okay. And so there must be something under here. So Now, <laughs> we can just take this out directly. We can hope doing this works. Well, we've already used boosters. We can't reach this, or we'd, we'd set it off. So this is the way we do it. Three boosters, level 461 is done. And I would recommend, if you're starting to get close like this, booster up in the beginning. Bring in some specials that can help you clear out the board in the beginning, uh, and then use any of the additional boosters during the game to help you. If you're still struggling and you want some more help or you want to challenge me to complete this without boosters, put that in the comment section. I'd be happy to help you. And if you want to see more videos, you can subscribe. Thanks for watching.